Imagine what it'll mean to the Republican Party when millions of women in our workforce who earn two-thirds as much as... Ellie, I thought we were going to try and get dressed today. It's only day two for the shirt, and these panties are fresh from the dryer. I'm glad you're here. We're discussing the equal pay bill. You want to get our party a good old boys to admit that the possession of a vagina doesn't automatically mean that a sister should get docked 32 cents on the dollar? Good for you, baby. Fight the power. It's just iced tea. It's... Well, then. Time to go bowling. All these years, we have never once used that fancy bowling alley. I'm going bowling, gentlemen. Redhead lady, I bid you farewell. Lizzie Bear. What did I say about calling me that? You are NC chairman. You come and go so frequently, I can never remember your names, and so I make up cute nicknames for you. You, you're Lizzie Bear. I was just in Texas, Cyrus. Dallas, having a lovely time raising money for the party, but I got on my broomstick and I flew in just to see you. Do you know why? I can't imagine. What did I tell you about our boy? Our boy? You mean the president of the United States of America? First, he's refused to do any fundraising, even though I specifically told you that the tragic death of his son would bring in millions of grief dollars. Second, he is pissing off our people. I've got senators and governors losing their crap at me on a daily basis over our boys' new liberal reach-across-the-aisle policies. Third, where the hell is Melly Grant? She's supposed to be our beacon of hope. She's supposed to win us women, mothers, people like that. And finally... There's more goody. I'm hearing rumors about a new attorney general. Rumors of a Democrat, Cyrus. A Democrat. Lizzie Bear. Cyrus. Thank you for coming. It was lovely to see you. Excuse me? Do you need to validate a ticket for your broomstick, or can you find your way out on your own? I have a sense of humor, Cy. Love a good joke. It's all in the timing, though. Goes on too long, people stop laughing. Just keep filling those coffers, Liz.